Hey, oh, ladies and gentlemen, and that beautiful technical rainbow in between, and welcome back to what might be the final episode of Fable Anniversary. I'm not certain. That's kind of what I thought about the last episode after we beat Jack of Blades, but I guess not. So, we need to go and enter the ancient necropolis. That way we can nice get the, what did Scythe call them? The Glyphs of Inquiry. That way Yay! we can use the Oracle to figure out why the summoners are deciding to wreak havoc on the world. I imagine it has something to do with, there was a mission that we did with Briar Rose in Darkwood Lake where the minions were trying to like summon something from an altar and we stopped them and the way it looked it looked like the summoners so excuse me oh hey um i'd like my physical barrier back please Frozen corpse? Is that what these guys are? Frozen hollow men? I ain't got time to deal with you assholes. I'm just trying to pass them. And the necropolis is where we should get the final silver key. Because I looked that up. I was just like, where are all the keys? I, I want to know. So the last one's in the necropolis. And then there's silver key chest in the necropolis and then there's the one down on the lost coast then there's a demon door in the necropolis but it's one that we'll have to do here in a moment thanks fellas oh yes so I told us to let you in well I guess you better shine through yeah Nice try, Mungo. It's your turn, and you know it. Ah, oh, nuts. All right, then. Follow me. <laughs> I mean, I get it. It's a place called the Necropolis. Never a joyous name. But still. Right, that's as far as I'm going. This place ain't safe, you know. The old town's full of ghosts. Folks say the poor beggars don't even realize they're dead. Anyway, take care looking for them, um, glyphs, they're called, right? You're not the first one that's come rummaging for pieces of carved stone, you know. The others found more than they bargained for, though. Rotting corpses, a lot of them now. Anyway, have a nice day. <laughs> Thanks, jackass. Any of these? Oh, oh. See, sounds like a lightsaber. to dig up every one of these spots, aren't I? Up 
Valverine. Is it a Valverine or is it a Valverine zombie? I don't know what happened to your children. That's not so nice. <laughs> Whatever that sound was. There's that other demon door. However, the problem with that demon door is it asks for my silver keys, and it'll take them all. Huh. Oh, cool, a summoner. Cool bag of money. And right here's the last silver key.
It seems you've mastered using them. Ah, oh, dope. You've received a new quest card. Guildmaster, this is not the time. Actually, what I want to do... Go back to the Lost Bay. Open that 30 key chest. Go back to the necropolis, give the demon door my keys, and then we'll go talk to the oracle. That is the plan right now. Man, 
I can't believe I ran out of uh, will potions. To be fair, I have been using uh, <laughs> my physical barrier spell all the fucking time. <laughs> Hoarder mode. Oh, it does less than what I have right now, anyways. I mean... Basically every fancy gem that I can give out as a gift. Alright, back to the demon door. Hey, look at that. I never wanted to be a demon, Lord. All this waiting around, all the vigils, it's no life. Oh, if only I'd been born a silver key chest. I just love those little silver keys. So shiny, so silver. I'd do anything for some of my own. Give me yours, please. I'll let you through and everything. I already opened all the chests, so yeah. Yes, yes, very good. And your keys over then. Lovely, pretty silver keys. Come to daddy. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, dude. You got real creepy about that there at the end. <laughs> that say says my middle finger. This one's got a couple different augments on it. Now I could go back to Snowspire. I could have traveled from here straight to Snowspire. Sometimes I'm a real dunce. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Alright, now we can uh, speak with the Oracle. Have a safe visit. Thanks. I will try my best. Uncovered the glyphs. Very good. It is time we awoke the Oracle from its deathly slumber. O oh, great Oracle, grant us the knowledge we seek. What evil rises in this land? Guildsman is here. You follow the footsteps of the one who wore the mask you carry. Jack of Blades has awakened the dormant power of the Summoners. He has used the blood of your family to feed his new shell 
beyond the bronze gate. But now his soul mask is in must use it to feed the Archon's shrine and open the gate. Go now and face your destiny. So Jack has cheated death once more. Never have we encountered a being like him. I do not envy you. The Bronze Gate has long been a symbol of doom in this land. Return to Briar Rose at the shrine. Perhaps she can tell you how to use Jack's soul mask. I must return to the guild. May fate smile on you. So that son of a bitch ain't dead? <laughs> After everything we went through in the last episode? You've received a new quest card. This is not the time, Guildmaster. What do you mean that asshole's still alive? You son of a... <sighs> okay... Enjoy yourself. What do we gotta do? man hey glad you're still with us these inscriptions are fascinating you know everything indicates that Jack's new form will emerge from behind the bronze gate and this structure is the key to opening it but it looks like it'll take the souls of three heroes to activate the mechanism these things are never simple are they it doesn't want just any heroes either. The first instruction calls for the king of the arena, no less. I suppose you could chop your own head off, but then there'd be no one for me to order around, would there? Bitch! Why don't you pay Thunder a visit? He knows the arena inside and out. I've checked with the guild, and they say he's a knothole glade. You've still got Jack's mask, haven't you? Good. You'll need it to trap the souls. I still can't believe he might not be dead. Anyway. I better start researching the second inscription. Okay, so. Yes, little hero, I'm back. And our business is not quite finished. You destroyed my sword, remember? Have you any idea how many centuries I spent looking for it? But its work is done. Soon I will have power beyond your imagining, and you will be the first to die. Motherfucker, I killed you once, I can do it again. Ah, cool, so this is my chance to finally get rid of Thunder. Son of a bitch. I'm sure it's gonna give me two choices, like, oh, killing Thunder is the evil choice, and then there's, this is the, like, good noble person choice where am i not whole blade but i don't like thunder so he's going to die i don't care if that's the evil choice <laughs> i'll let my inner darkness well up within me again <laughs> your lack of faith is disturbing <laughs> No, now it's... look, I won't tell you again. We don't need a hero. For the first time in years, we aren't being attacked, sieged, or kidnapped by anything. Now leave us alone. Time to die, Thunder. You? <laughs> Briar Rose said you would come. I will tell you what I know. If it will get you out of my sight. We were both once called Kings of the Arena. But there have been many heroes in the past who have claimed that name. You should search in the bloody dust of the arena itself. They say the souls of past champions haunt it, resting in the place of their greatest achievement. Now go, 
Unless you're here to take my soul, just as you took my sister. Oh, you bet I am, bitch ass. I expected no less. Let's finish this. Because if I leave you alive, you're just going to come after me again to try and reclaim. Oh, jeez. Okay, well. Try and get Lady Grey back from me. Yeah, right. I don't have my physical barrier. She looked up to you. You're her brother. Shut up and die. Ninety-one on the alignment. It could be worse. I mean, don't get me wrong. I feel bad. I do when I don't. I do feel bad because I never really wanted it to come to that, but him and his sister. I hope this pricks. thing works. We need to release the soul from the mask, and, and well, your guess is as good as mine. <sighs> Was that Thunder's soul? That's not exactly what I had in mind when I sent you to him. Anyway, we figured out the second inscription. It says, The Heroine. I can't think of anyone who fits the description better than Scarlet Robe, your mother. There's always me, of course, but as you can see, I'm still alive. And I plan to stay that way. You'll have to pay her tomb in Oakvale another visit. I know this won't be easy, but Scarlet was always one to make sacrifices, remember? Fair enough. I think my mom would be honored. It's definitely a heart tearing kind of idea, but Thunder was just a person. Oh, the worm or Scarlet. Oh, Hadn't shut she up. suffered enough? Would you really do that to your own mother? Take Briar. She is of no use to anyone. 
fuck off, dude. I'll do what I want. I already feel bad for killing Thunder, sort of. <laughs> I'm not gonna kill Briar Rose. Sure, she's been a colossal bitch, but I'm not just gonna murder her for no reason. We can do a special offer for you, sir. I'm all of them, please, God. Something tells me there's going to be a lot of screaming. <laughs> You're not funny. So you filled the graveyard with banshees. That's what I'm pulling from that. <laughs> you think you're clever, but you're not. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize mom was going to come out and say hello. You know, it'd be great if you actually looked at something. I can't see shit, dude. Wow, I'm losing health like it ain't no one's business. I can't see shit. is strong, and his new form is almost ready. But I sense how he fears you. Take my soul, and avenge our family once and for all. And make him pay, son. I will, Mom. I'll make you proud. <sighs> Please don't moan like that. It, it makes me very uncomfortable, Mother. Oh. We think we've deciphered the third inscription. Come back to the shrine and I'll show you. Got it. I'm sure your mother would be proud. Now, there's just one inscription left. The oldest song. But we still haven't figured out who that might mean. Oh, come. We both know who it is, dear Briar. You can't protect the old fool any longer. It's the Guildmaster the Shrine once, hero. Jack? So it really is true. He's alive, and still up to his old mind games. I hope the Guild Acolytes can come up with a better idea. You should go back to the Guild and speak with them. Okay. So the evil choice would be the Guild Master. So then what's the good choice? Guess we'll have to figure that one out. Also, I should buy some more potions while I'm here. 
That would be the smart thing to do. <laughs> oh, what? Welcome back, sir. This place has been a mess since you left. People running around with bits of old paper, books flying everywhere. And a guild master's only gone and hold himself up in the guild woods. We're not supposed to let anyone near him. We found it. The soul mentioned in the inscription. It must be Nostro. His soul has been trapped in the Litchfield graveyard for centuries. Our texts suggest it should be in the graveyard circle, you know, where you found the tunnel to Bargate Prison. Catching souls? Never heard such nonsense. Well, good luck, hero. Thanks. First things first. Potion seller. There's Reaper. Well, you think we can do a special offer for you, sir? Please do. I need your finest quality potions, potion seller. Can I not? Wait, but huh? Huh? Why can't I buy any more potions? Oh, probably because I'm fucking broke. <laughs> Why, you little scroat? Uh, bitch, I paid you for the potions. Yeah, being broke is a joke would probably, you know, answer the question. God, now I gotta go all the way to the graveyard. This is gonna be fun. I don't imagine he'll just, you know, give me his soul. It can never be easy, can it? Howdy, fellas. <sighs> Circle of dead. Circle of the dead. Oh, fun. Bitch, stop that. Get out of my face. Is that electricity that I hear? Oh, because it's a summoner. Look, fight me later. Good God. Still not dead? You're resilient. Piss <laughs> 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 off for like two seconds. Taken care of. Oh, Nostro. Nostros? 
Why can't I remember his name all of a sudden? Nostros? Guildsmen, we meet once more. You reclaimed my weapons and armor and brought me peace. Now, I offer my soul in return. But I am Nostro. Mine is a warrior's soul. You must take it in battle so that I may stand proud among my comrades in the afterlife. My men have sworn an oath to protect me even in death. Only when they fall can I be harmed. Now, claim my soul with honor. Oh, he's become incorporeal. Ah, nice. I see. Was not as bad as it could have been. Thanks, my dude. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. Can I please fast travel? Thanks. So Jack has a new form, eh? The inscriptions say only one hero will be allowed to pass through the gate, and, hey, guess what? You're the strongest. Bitch. I don't know what form Jack's going to take, but I don't think it's going to be small and furry, do you? Good luck. For all our sakes. Maybe I should have killed her. You're too late, little hero. Once more, too late. You've received a new breast card. We have unfinished business. Okay. Also, again, Guildmaster. Really not the time. <laughs> I'm on my way. All right, Jack, let's finish this shit. Ooh. 
Okay, the sky's got dark and red. Loving that. Archon's Folly. Okay. Oh, Jackie boy. Show yourself. I am no mortal man. The gods and demons you fear and worship are as nothing to me. Um. Fucking. What? Excuse me? So he turned himself into a dragon, eh? That's what you are. times, Jack. Two fucking times. You ate my shit. 
that bitch away. Get the hell out of here. It was a battle that will be talked about for centuries to come. The day the hero of Oakvale slew the dragon, Jack of Blades. The day the strange creature behind the mask was finally banished from this world. And this is where our tale must end. Though even the most hopeful of hearts knew the struggle between good and evil would never be truly over. As for what became of the guild and its heroes, that is a story for another time. Well... Unfortunately, I know what happens, as I've played Fable 2 and 3. <laughs> so... Oh, that's it! Awesome! We killed Jack twice! Nice! <laughs> Honestly, this was good, actually. This was, like, really good. I was j I know I didn't show it a lot in the way I was talking. Like, I probably sound very mundane about everything that happened. But genuinely, I thought this was a really good game. It's one of those... I had already played it up to the point where you had to sneak into um, Twin Blades Bandit Camp. But that was the point where I was like, okay, I should probably stop playing for a little bit. And yada yada and then I just never picked it up again until now so uh, this was really interesting and fun and enjoyable <laughs> the game the controls are a little hokey I definitely like 2 and 3 better because their controls are a little bit cleaner and the animation style is better but then again that's to be expected because this was made for like the original Xbox and not the Xbox 360 or the Xbox One, which is what I'm playing it on. So, that being said, I really did enjoy this Let's Play. If you all enjoyed this video and this series, please hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, hit that bell icon so you don't miss anything else from me. And if there's any Let's Plays that you want to see me do, then leave it down in the comments. I do you know, try to read through the comments when I can. With that being said, I hope everybody's enjoyed this series. If you have, like I said, hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll see you all in the next adventure, all right? Stay awesome, and much love, everyone. Bye!